Well, a legendary figure in local science who almost flew on the ill-fated Challenger space shuttle mission has died. Mike Reynolds, who many of you remember as Channel 4's science analyst, he was 65 years old. News for Jack's Rebecca Berry is joining us now with a look back at Mike's remarkable career. Rebecca? It's been a sad day as the news of Professor Mike Reynolds passing away started to ripple through the scientific community. Reynolds was an educator at FSCJ. He was known for his infectious enthusiasm for science, particularly astronomy and space exploration. He taught at Fletcher in the early parts of his career where he was awarded Florida Teacher of the Year in 1981. He moved on to Planetarium Director at MOSH and was a member of several groups focusing on astronomy, telescopes, and space observation. He led expeditions around the world to view solar eclipses and recover meteorites. He wrote several books, my favorite of which is Observe Eclipses. Reynolds was picked out of 12,000 educators nationwide to fly in NASA's Teacher in Space program in 1985. Fellow educator Krista McAuliffe was ultimately chosen for the Challenger mission, which ended tragically. Before the mission, Reynolds and McAuliffe became friends, and after the Challenger exploded, Reynolds took on an outreach position in her honor. When Tarek Miner interviewed Reynolds about the Challenger mission, he explained how watching the explosion changed his life. One was knowing that every day here on Earth is a gift, and so use that time wisely and you know stick to your your mission your god-given gifts and 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 that's probably one of the reasons that you know i love education so much and have stayed in education reynolds inspired countless students his classes at fscj had a waiting list to get into because he made science so much fun they've been headed to his facebook page to memorialize him ben palmer says i'll never forget and i'm forever grateful to have worked alongside him in astronomy he brought the stars to life. He embodied the truest soul astronomy could have. The art and heart of looking up always rested with him. Our galaxy has a new star in the sky tonight. Eric says, keep looking up. Memories sustain you as remember and reflect on your loss and gain from this incredible teacher. And Robert says, the stars just became a little dimmer. Godspeed, Dr. Mike Reynolds. And so when we hear of the funeral arrangements for Dr. Mike Reynolds, we will add them to an article we've put on newsforjacks.com, which compiles some of our favorite times when Mike Reynolds was here with us on air on newsforjacks.com. All right, Rebecca, thanks. Gosh. Yeah, I remember uh, interviewing him. He's such a bright light in the classroom. Yeah. I mean, just, I mean, it just when he spoke, uh, he just encouraged and inspired all the students to really, you know, learn about science. Yeah, it sounds like he touched so many lives. What a legacy.